I hear it. I hate this game. That's so close. Ladies and gentlemen, we're back at it again. Guys, today I'm in a new location. It's a little bit of an upgrade, okay? And today we're playing the Lancaster League O'Brien Stake Park. Now this is another game made by the same people who played... Who made the last game I just played called... I think it was called... What was it called? What was it called? What was it? Entity exam. It, entity exam, exactly. It was called Entity Exam. I thought the game was so cool. I got so scared. And I couldn't really sleep last night. So I want to play another one because I like that. No, I'm not a masochist, okay? I just like these type of things, all right? Calm down there, Bill. Jay, I hope this one's just as scary as the last one. I think it's the same. Actually, I don't know if it's a test format. I didn't look into it. I just downloaded it. So I got another for us to say. Let's get straight into it. Bah! The following tape and many others were recovered by FBI. In turn, Valerie Bardot and given it to us. Ew. Leaving without a trace, she suddenly went missing. At the. Can we not start off like this? Can we please not start off like this? Foul play is suspected. My goodness. So long as Valerie is missing. Now, Valerie's in the last game. These tapes will continue to be leaked. We give you a chance, and this is something. Um, I'm scared. FBI warning. The information conveyed through this tape, the de debrief training tape, which contains a prior investigation, it is imperative that agents refrain from viewing this material unless they possess the approaching clearance and are under the direct supervision of an instructor. Um,. I don't got one of those. Oh, I didn't get to read the rest because I was looking for my superior. <sighs> Tape purpose debrief date that. 19 TS. <coughs> O'Brien State Park, previously inhabited by both Dakota and Ojibwe tribe. I probably butchered that. Is now home to year round camper and hikers. Campers and hikers is what it should be, but I'm not gonna knock you guys. Oh, I gotta get. I, I was just about to say I gotta get reading before it disappears. I'm so sorry. You guys can pause and read this on your own on August 25th, 1988. Brandy Kaufman, a 59 year old male, visited O'Brien State Park and accompanied the subject's behavior during the visit was unusual. He intermediately a recording. Subsequently, subsequently, on August 26th, his subject was reported as missing. His body was discovered on August. What am I doing? 30th, and the recovering footage from his recording device will now be represented in a chronological order accompanied by annotations. See, I got that one. So you're gonna subscribe to my channel. Nope. Oh boy, this is not like the last one at all. I actually gotta play. The subject would occasionally zoom. So you know this. Man, these graphics are whack -a whack and whack and cheese, dude. Great, so I gotta actually play a game instead of just watch some tapes like the last one. I did not sign up for this, but I think this is gonna be more scary, which I don't know how I feel. I don't know, because the last one was the most unsettling game I've ever played by far. It was, it was horrifying. It was, um, I thought I was getting cursed. It just left me with a super uneasy feeling. Okay, I can't go there. And I don't know, something about it was just off. I like it. Really? That's how I'm getting scared? Car horn? This is not gonna be a fun one. It is for you though, because you get to watch me suffer. Or do you get scared alongside me? Hmm. Um. But yeah, I'm gonna. I don't know how good I sound right now, or bad. I got a new mic and I'm in a new location. It's probably a little more echoey, but it's better. Okay, it's. 
It's all an improvement. Oh, you can probably still hear my PC fan sound like turbo jet engines. What? I'm so confused, what am I supposed to do? Pause, one. The subject stops filming, then takes a shower. It is estimated 10... <laughs> Who do they think I am? They really think I can be that fast? Anyways, um... Someone's taking a pee pee poo poo in here. I can smell you. I know a dump when I hear it. <laughs> smell it. Okay, quick potty break or shower break for some reason. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing now. That's my that's my objective. I don't know if I'm supposed to be going get, uh, back. Um, I'm confused, scared, and I'm gonna poop my pants. Is that a unicorn one? Yeah, it's beast talk, Aaron. Guys, I'm a little emotional. I just got done watching season four, episode seven of Mr. Robot, and it was one of the greatest episodes of a show I've ever seen in my entire life. Um, go watch it. Not that exact episode, but watch the show. And when you get to that episode, you'll thank me. Okay. Now I heard a. What makes that noise? Coyote? A wolf? I don't know, man. Probably a coyote. We're fine. That's a human? Is that a someone? Sir? Upon return to the campsite, an unknown figure stands near the subject's tent. Neither the campground records nor witnesses recall seeing a white male of this profile. Why this person was here or who they are still remains unknown is not being actively pursued. There you go, I read it fast for you. The largest jump of times happened between this point and an estimated one to two hours time elapsed. Recording resumes with the subject two miles in the Hardwood Hills loop. Why the subject started to hike is not relevant to the Bureau's involvement. I'm so confused on what's happening. Are we studying someone's tape and I'm playing as a tape that's being studied? Excuse me. So now I'm going downhill. So there's a dude named Clarence at my camp. He was asked for a hot dog. I said, no, bro, I'm out of weenies. He said, no, I see one right there. I said, what are you talking about? And then he pulled out my pants. Forgive me, that was, that was a terrible joke. Anyways, um, I don't know what's happening. Now, is anyone here right now? Nope. That's what I thought. Okay. I don't like the zoom feature because it takes longer to zoom out. Now, if I need my peripherals, what am I supposed to do when I need to see my, with my, with my prey eyes, I need to see the predator coming. What? Um, I mean, what animal makes that noise? Uh, I was just about to say, I'm actually not very scared right now. This isn't that bad. This is quite literally. A walk in the park. <laughs> but nothing's happened yet, which is fine. 
It's a build-up. It's a slow cooker. Now, some of you may be bored right now, to which I say to that. Are you here for the game? Or are you here for quality time with me? Don't answer that. I already know the answer. It's fine. You should be here. Because... Oh my goodness, I thought that was like a rake or something. Because I enjoy spending time with you. Is it... Is the feeling mutual? Nope. Exactly. I knew that. But you know what? I'm not going to stoop down to your level. And I'm going to contain my high values and caring for for you whilst I don't get the same energy because that's the type of person I am. Now tell me, is that the type of person you want to be the way you are right now? Yes. Alright, whatever. You know what? I'm sick of you. I'm just going to keep walking down this path. Ain't no buck going to scare me. Okay? Buck making cow noises. All right, no, no buck goes... Okay. I don't understand what I'm playing right now. Nothing's happening. Now that's what I was thinking when I think of a deer. I think of that. Or like a caribou. What's that noise from Polar Express? <laughs> when the train's coming up on the caribou. They make that type of noise, like little... That was awful. I'm so sorry. Um, nothing's happening. Probably talking to myself because who is going to tune in for this? Uh, quite literally walking down a trail. Um, now what I do want to say is look at this chopstick lightsaber. Is this not the coolest invention you've ever seen? Okay, and then you can also drum. Oh, alright, enough. No, he died. That's Bambi's dad. The deceased deer was killed by Antitty. So was I, I guess. Subject encountered deceased deer attacked by Entity. The film abruptly ends after the subject detects Entity in vicinity. Subject exhibits distress and flees off trail. So he pursues subject and can be head Heard in proximity. Subject resumes filming approximately four minutes after pause. This marks the final pause. Guys, we're in the end game. Such as audible first time displaying emotions of fear. This actually sounds more fatigue, but I'm gonna let that slide. Subject running shift has multiple sounds of entities around him. Oh. I can't run with shift. Shift's not working. Oh, I was crouched. Don't tell me I was crouched this whole time. And I could have been running faster. That would be a darn shame, wouldn't it? So they're like skinwalkers pretending to be the deer. Ah! Oh, I hate that. Chills, 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 chills. What am I supposed to do? I hear it. I hate this game. That's so close. My game froze. The subject struggles against Entity, but sets away. The camera is severely damaged. <laughs> so subject drops outside the camera and Chris shut it back up. <laughs> so their blood creeps into frame. <laughs> Dude, calm down. It's like you're 
die, dude. Chill. Brady Kroffman's death would occur over the next five minutes. The remaining footage have been cut short for viewer discretion. Additional entities can be heard and would later fight over the remains. The footage ends when the something camera dies. Subject remains were found scattered, mostly fresh was consumed. Little personal items remain intact. The public was told it was an abnormal bear attack. Ooh, the tibia. Tough. The subject's film was the first footage captured of Sue of S. That. Ultimately, the subject's footage provided the Bureau of Proof to extend funding and special operation to contain entities. This case marks first of many successful entity resolution programs. Entity debrief. Name Wendigo. ID that. Risk severe. Containability 3. This is like. No, this is like from the last game. Wendigo is a creature originated from North Native American tribes of Great Lakes regions. The male volant. I don't know what that word is. New, supernatural beings bring terror. To, I hate this game. <laughs> According to a recent intelligence, there has been a notable resurgence of the Wendigo, and their geographical distribution has now examined southward towards Minneapolis. Ooh, they're entering the states. In response to the emerging threat, the Bureau has established a joint task force. Or Captain Price? No, they're just not going to let me read. It is imperative to maintain strict oper operational security and keep the general public uninformed of these operations to prevent any unnecessary panic or interference. Alright, y'all, that was the Lancaster League. Oh, Brian State Park. It was a cute game. It was cute. It was cool. It was creepy. It was cute. It was cool. It was creepy. I just said that. I'm gonna say it again. It was cute. This felt. This game felt more like a heart-to-heart -heart conversation between me and you. And hey, I value that. So to me, this is the best game I've ever played. Aww. Stop it. Stop. Show y'all light little video for today. Okay, get y'all a little kibble for your day. All right. Nice little new location I got here. I'm in my own room this time. Little setup going. Got the piano right here. So, y'all, thank you all for joining me. Thank you for watching. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Calm down. Calm down. Not yet. Like, subscribe. Thank you. Peace out, everybody.